Today we have brought you the latest Tesla news. Tesla releases incredible Q4 2021 vehicle safety report, nine times safer with autopilot engaged. Tesla may start using a new camera with FSD hardware 4.0, starting with Cybertruck. Tesla Giga Texas is now officially located on Tesla Road. And, another Tesla Model Y body with space for a structural battery pack, spotted at Giga Texas. Let's get into all the details. So let's get started. Tesla released its vehicle safety report for Q4 2021, which shows that its vehicles using autopilot are nine times safer than other vehicles on the United States roads driven by human pilots. According to NHTSA data, car accidents occur every 484,000 miles in the U.S. Meanwhile, Tesla reported that in Q4 2021, it recorded one crash for every 4.31 million miles driven, in which drivers had autopilot engaged. The new data demonstrate Tesla Autopilot's continued strong safety record. Thus, Autopilot is nine times safer than a human driver. The data also show that Autopilot has improved over time, as its safety performance has improved since Q4 2020, when one accident was registered for every 3.45 million miles driven, in which drivers had Autopilot engaged. Comparison of indicators for the same period of different years is the best means for a correct assessment since it excludes the influence of seasonality. For those driving without autopilot and without Tesla's active safety features, the company registered one accident for every 1.59 million miles driven, which is better than in the same period in 2020, where there was one registered accident every 1.27 miles driven. In the fourth quarter, we recorded one crash for every 4.31 million miles driven, in which drivers were using autopilot technology. For drivers who were not using autopilot technology, we recorded one crash for every 1.59 million miles driven. By comparison, NHTSA's most recent data shows that in the United States, there is an automobile crash every 484,000 miles. Tesla wrote in its report, Active safety features are standard on all Tesla vehicles, built after September 2014, providing an additional layer of safety beyond the physical structure of the vehicle. The company uses data from all of its vehicles on the road to better understand how accidents happen. After analyzing the data, Tesla continues to develop features that help Tesla drivers mitigate or avoid accidents. Moving to the next update. Tesla may start using a new camera with FSD hardware 4.0, starting with Cybertruck. Tesla may start using a new camera in its cars, along with the new FSD hardware 4.0, which will be used for the first time in Cybertruck, according to rumors. The new camera has a number of advantages and may lead to a reduction in their total number in the car. While Tesla had no plans to give an informational update on FSD hardware 4.0, a question about the new computer was asked during the AI Day event in August 2021. The company's CEO Elon Musk said, the current hardware 3.0 computer is already capable of full self-driving and safer than human pilot, but Tesla wants to keep improving. That is why the Tesla AI team is always striving to develop new and powerful computers. Hardware 4.0 was the fruit of this desire, and it seems that in the near future, the company will launch cars with the new computer on the market. Musk suggested that in 2022, the public will be able to see hardware 4.0. According to him, the iconic Cybertruck will be equipped with the new hardware. In another response regarding new hardware, Musk also said that Tesla is looking into new cameras. While the current cameras are already great, if Tesla can do better, then they will. Tesla currently uses three separate forward-facing cameras in a housing at the top of the windshield. This unit contains wide-angle, standard, and narrow-view lenses with three separate CMOS sensors. Each sensor has a resolution of 1280 by 960, or about 1.2 megapixels. However, according to a statement by Chris Zheng on Twitter, Tesla is planning to use the new Sony IMX490 automotive image sensor in its upcoming 4.0 hardware version. 
which has a number of advantages over the current ones. The new sensors support a much higher resolution of 2896 by 1876, which is 5.4 megapixels. New sensors with be more than four times the resolution of existing sensors allow the system to more accurately detect objects around the vehicle. It will also provide a more detailed image, which improves accuracy in a wide variety of situations. The new sensor could allow Tesla to reduce the number of forward-facing cameras to two or even one. Here are the new camera specs, according to Sony. All these features make the new sensor a much better option than the current one. Shooting HDR at 10-bit resolution at 40 FPS, delivering better contrast and richer colors, and maintaining LED flicker reduction is also critical in today's realities. Moving to the next update, Tesla Giga Texas is now officially located on Tesla Road. Tesla Giga Texas changed the address of its location, which obviously became possible, not because of a move, but instead because of a change in street name. According to the document, the Travis County Commissioner's Court has changed the name of the public road along which the factory is located as Tesla Road. It seems Tesla has started a new tradition to rename the street on which it builds its new factories, naming them after itself. Given the hugely positive impact on the surrounding areas and the economy of these regions, the change in street names is quite justified. In 2020, the street where Giga Berlin is located was officially renamed to Tesla Strabe, and now the street where Giga Texas is located is also officially renamed to Tesla Road. January 11, the Travis County Commissioner's Court unanimously passed Item 21 on their agenda, allowing for the change of Harold Green Road near Tesla's factory to Tesla Road. According to the order, the street was renamed as most of the property owners along Harold Green Road approved Tesla Road as the new name of the street. The first public signs that Tesla intends to rename the street on which Giga Texas is located appeared in November 2021 when the office of the CEO at Tesla Amiat Afshar posted a photo with the new street sign on Twitter. He commented on the photo, Welcome to Giga Texas, on Tesla Road. However, as it turned out at the time, the placement of the sign was advanced and resulted from a misunderstanding, according to Texas Department of Transportation's public information officer, via KVUE. Texas Department of Transportation, Travis County, and Tesla have been in constant communication about infrastructure during construction of the factory off Harold Green Road, the spokesperson said. As the result of a miscommunication, the Tesla road signs were placed on State Highway 130 before the county officially signed off. Now, after the county officially signed the order renaming the street, the established mark is placed there legally. Moving to the last update, another Tesla Model Y body with space for a structural battery pack spotted at Giga Texas. More evidence has been spotted at Giga Texas that Tesla could begin Model Y production with structural battery packs. During a drone flyover of the factory recently by Joe Tegmeyer, another Model Y test car was spotted outside the factory. While this is not an unusual sight at Giga Texas, this test body has a gaping hole underneath it, where the floor should usually be. Instead, the floor will be added with the installation of a structural battery pack, to which the seats will attach directly to it, as seen at Giga Berlin last year. This is yet another sign that when Tesla gets the go-ahead to begin Model Y production, they will feature structural battery packs with 4680 cells. Supporting the theory, Tesla updated the Model Y owner's manual this week to include reference to the new feature, hinting that it could be in production at Giga Texas very soon. Long lines of 4680 battery cell production equipment has also been spotted inside the factory. Even if this equipment is not up and running yet, Tesla has previously said their pilot production facility on Cato Road has enough capacity to scale Model Y production at Giga Texas. The Model Y test body was not the only interesting sighting made by Tegmeyer on Friday. The drone operator also spotted two trucks delivering four Sedinsa modular paint components for the paint shop. That's it for now. So what are your thoughts about this? Let us know in the comments. 
Stay tuned at the electric arena for all the latest Tesla and electric vehicle news.